What's going on? My name is Chad. I'm your tall tailor and today we're going to be making a vinyl vest. But before we get started, I want to say thank you guys so much for 100 subs. It means a lot to me when you guys share, sub to the channel, even like DM me stuff like, yo, I like the stuff you're doing, keep it up, that kind of stuff. Thank you guys. So the vest that I'm making is for my really good friend James. He's a homie. He actually has his own brand called Just the Kid. They have like t-shirts and totes. And hoodies it's really cool so you guys should check it out I'll put the link in the description now this vest is a little bit different than the previous vest I made on my channel it's made of vinyl obviously so it's a little bit different in terms of material but the construction is a tiny bit different as well too and aesthetically it looked totally different but that's enough talking let's get to sewing first things first we need our material and here I have vinyl and it's a really nice material to make a vest out of it's soft it's light and overall a really good looking material I already had the measurements I needed so I'm just tracing the measurements onto the fabric and I fold the fabric in half because the front and the back of the vest are essentially the same. And here you just see me using Taylor's chalk to mark out the various parts of the vest, the neck, the armholes, and the bust. And now I'm just cutting out the parts I marked out. I'm making sure that the front and the back of the vest are together because as I said they're essentially the same. So now I'm just separating the front and the back. As you can see, I put the back away and now the front, I'm cutting out the other part of the armhole. I'm folding in half because it becomes a lot easier to mirror one side of the vest to the other so that it's perfect and aligns well. Now the front portion of the vest is cut in half. I'm gonna put a zipper there later, as well as cutting an angle on the shoulders. I cut out all three of the pockets, a small, medium, a large as well as a two inch trim that's gonna go around each of the pockets. Now I'm adding the zipper to the pockets because obviously you know you need a place to <laughs> put your hand in, put some stuff in the pockets, and then I'm just sewing the zipper on. And now I'm pinning the trim all the way around the pockets, and then I'm gonna add a stitch there as well just to secure everything in place. All right, so now that the zipper's attached, I'm just going to repeat this process with the other two pockets, the large one and the medium pocket. I'm just placing them over the vest where I think that they should be. And after, I'm just gonna stitch them on. Now that the two panels of the vest are done, I cut the lining, two more pieces for the front and for the back. I chose a gray lining because it complements the color of the vest as well too. Now I'm adding these four side strips that are going to adjust the width of the vest and I'm just sewing velcro onto those strips because velcro is pretty much the best way to adjust the width. Now we're in the home stretch, I'm adding in the lining. I put the lining and the vest face to face, sewed it together and now I'm just going to add a top stitch over the part where I stitched together and this is the exact time where I'd add the zipper. Now I just repeat the process on the left, the right, and the back of the vest. And we're done. I really liked how the vest turned out, and I'm not sure if you guys can pick this up, but it's not really black. The vest is more like a uh, like a dark charcoal color, and it has this uh, unique texture. It kind of looks like marble, like sporadically placed over the the vest. It's like a really cool, a really cool texture. And the lining complements the vest as well too. Check out my Instagram at the tall tailor. I have a couple pictures there on my page. If you like this video, make sure to drop a like, comment, share, all that kind of stuff. Thank you guys again so much for watching. Hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.